You cool down then yet? I guess. I ain't no scullion, and I sure as hell ain't taking orders from that sweating halfwit. I guess we all gotta do our share, Princess. <laughs> Where's that letter? Are oh, you reading his mail now? Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Mm. Here. <clears throat> no, what was Dear it? Aunt Kathy. You are something else. I haven't heard from you in <laughs> some time. So I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah, blah, blah. It's boring. Ooh. <laughs> Wait a sec. Listen to this. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. <laughs> you ever actually even talk to a woman he ain't paid for? Oh, look. We're all hiding behind something. <laughs> and what's this? Return to Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, that. Now that's Dutch's idea. All male to be sent to the same alias. Whenever we set up somewhere new, Strauss, he heads into town. Tells him to start expecting mail from a Tacitus Kilgore or whatever they changed it to. <laughs> Here, give me that back. We got work to do. Beautifully parked. So, what's the plan? I shoot the shopkeeper while you. No, you insane. I thought we was outlaws. Outlaws, not idiots. <laughs> we rob fools that rob other people. These people, they're just trying to get by. So, you head on in there, you buy some food to eat. And no guns. You're sure? This time, there'll be time for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Nothing exciting. I do have a feeling she's gonna shoot something. What did you get there, Harold? Nothing. What do you mean? Hey, watch where you're going. Can I help you, mister? Yes, I would like to post a letter. Alright. Okay, no trouble. Thank you. Bye now. Uh, or is the wagon gone? Come on, move on. Burn foals with more strength than you. Help! My sister's newborn had more strength than you, and he came out bright blue. I'm trying. Where did she get his clothes from? I think this is everything. Thanks. Here, take that for yourself, okay? Thanks. Well, give it back then. Jesus. I didn't ask for his goddamn help. Just blew off him. Okay, get on. I'm about done here. <laughs> Why don't you drive? Okay. Come on, lady, get a move on. I like Sadie, not lady. I know. So, you get everything? I think so. And some new clothes, I see. Don't start. I know. I can wear what I damn well want. Like I told you, my husband and I shared all the work. I wasn't some little wife with a flower in her hair making cherry pies all day. Yeah, I don't doubt that. You sure look the part now. Won't be long before you're smoking cigars and playing the harmonica. I'll have you know. I used to love playing the harmonica before. Well, my house and everything I own got burned to the ground. I know. I'm real sorry about what you 
You know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want no pity. Just treat me equal and no. Nobody's taking nothing from me. <laughs> mm-hmm. Just don't kill the camp cook. Hey there! Hey. What, uh... What you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in the Morn Raider country. Pretty cool. <laughs> you need to pay a toll to pass through here. No, I don't think so. You don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Pull over? That's what I said. Hey! How's about this? Go, go, go! Um. Here. Why? Because you've caused enough trouble already. I'm fine. Careful! We showed those bastards, huh? Remind me not to get on your bad side. And they was clearly planning to bushwhack us. Did good. But that's a lot of mess to make near camp. Hope it don't bring anyone sniffing around. Are you... Yeah, I missed a turn. Dutch. You sure this is the right way? Maybe. If he asks. But maybe not. Yep. So who did they say they were? Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah, something like that. They've been going so well last summer. Anyway, don't you go ribbon piercing about that letter. How dare you? I wouldn't dream of it. Right, you wouldn't. I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> I won't be giving you no mail to post anytime soon, that's for sure. <laughs> I just want to peek in that journal of yours. The mind of boggles. Not a chance. I quite like that her partner. yourself killed then, Miss Adler. Not quite. <laughs> well, I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but I'd be lying. I... I enjoyed myself out there. Yes, we, uh... Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping? Yes, at shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe. <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well, they say I lack finesse, but... I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. And nice pants, by the way. Oh, shut up. I like her. She's cool. Right. Another person out here before we rob the homestead. Can I have a quick word? Yes, Miss O'Shea. Ah, call me Molly, would you? Oh. Arthur, how is Dutch? I mean, how does he seem to you? I'm about the same as usual, I guess. I, I really love him, you know. 
But if he... Like he always says, loyalty is everything, so... Arthur! Excuse me, Miss O'Shea. What you want? I bring a gift. The great gift of information. So you got some tip-off, so now I can risk my neck and make you some money while you lounge around. You know, Arthur, bitterness, it, it works on the inside as well as on your sour face. If you say so, you could go find some other fool to run your errands. Bill, come on over here. Will you be my other fool? You too, Charles. What are you? Talking about. Arthur's above a little stick up I heard about. No, I'm not. You just said hey, I'll do it. As long as you ride with us. <laughs> well, I got a serious medical condition. Yes, you are a compulsive liar. No need to be like that. Charles, have I ever lied to you? I hardly know you. Exactly. Now you boys should do this. It, it's easy, and I'll only take a small commission for my information. But it's now or never. Then it's never. Oh, God help me. Fine, I'll do it. <laughs> well, what is it? It's a supply wagon carrying payroll, but very briefly unguarded, apparently. As it passes through a crossroads near here where there's an old ruined church, it connects with the rest of the wagon train. Very easy picking. As long as we get paid or you get shot, I'm happy. You are a sick man, Arthur Morgan. A very sick man indeed. <laughs> Come on, then, you miserable bastards! How do you get wind of this old man? We only been down here all of five minutes! While you boys been off fishing or playing lawman or whatever the hell you been doing, I've been getting down to business. <laughs> Finding the nearest grog house. Hey, you don't want in on this, Williamson, that's fine by me. Do us all a favor. Head home. Just give it a rest, you two. Just have a little faith for once, will you? I've been scoping jobs like this since you fellers were knee-high to a grasshopper. Once a decade, maybe. So what is it you scoped here, exactly? Well, I told you. There's a wagon with a lockbox passes through every week. Okay, hold up here. We should cover our faces. Well, they'll be passing through the crossroads up ahead. When? Soon, Williamson. Christ's sakes. I should be due any time now. Let's keep this quiet and clean. Nobody needs to die here. There! You see, gentlemen? <laughs> Just like clockwork. <laughs> ah. You know, boys, I, I don't, I don't want to get shot, but this is a mistake. I work for Cornwall Kerosene and Tar, Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Oh, great. So you know him? <laughs> Who doesn't? I hear he's rich enough to share the wealth around and not miss it too much. Oh, he'll miss it. Okay, why don't you check out around the back? Arthur, help me out here. Okay, we're looking good. Must be nearly a thousand here. Shit! Hey! Think I see something! Oh, great. Let's go! Parker, let's go! Yeah! Yeehaw! Come on! 
You have to, can't you? Just shut up, would you? Quick! Get off the trail! Into the woods! Let's shake him and get back to camp! No, we need to find a place to lie low. We can't risk leading Cornwall's men to camp. All right! Here. Whoa! Let, let, let's hide in here. Quick! Whoa! Get out of here! Get out of here, go on. I'll see you later. All right. Let's get out of sight. Stay until dark, and then we'll sneak out of here. Charles, you keep watching now. Sure. Well, we, uh, get some rest. Uh. All right. Let's try and get out of here. Hey, shit. Absolutely. Well, shut up, old man. Look, I was just trying to... Shut up. There's a light. Over by the house. Damn! I don't know. Let's just keep this calm. See what happens. Is this your place? Kinda. Uh, and you didn't hear nothing? I, I, why don't you just tell me, partner, what you heard? I, I, tell me what you heard. I don't... Heard some noises out by the barn a while ago. Ain't me. Ain't gonna not be. Ah, oh, shit. All right. Cooped forth. Low. Go check out the, the barn. Sir. Place looks deserted enough. Sure. You head inside, I'll go around the back. God damn it, Arthur! What was that? Let's fly at them, boys! Out of the way, Uncle! On this side! Where are they all coming from? Looks like Mr. Cornwall's got it. Don't alarm him. More on the right here! Get the top of me! This fella really don't like getting robbed! Let's just hope we don't run out of bullets! God damn it! What happened to keep this coal heart hurt? They were seconds from finding us anyway. There's a goddamn horde of them on the left here. Stop uh, 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 in this way now. Boom. I've got this, Uncle. If I have an aim to do it. Come on, old man! 
Where are we going, Bill? We'll try to lose him in the woods. Jesus Christ. Let's split up a bit. Try to confuse him. Arthur, with me. Get the hell off me! Arthur! Made a meal out of that, didn't you? This is a young man's game. Uh oh, clearly those boys ain't as quiet as us. Guess we should go give them a hand. Yeah. Oh, Split up long, run quick. Good luck, Jess. Stay quiet and move. <laughs> Time to go, boy. Get up. Wetness now. Right, where are we going? Back to camp. 